We're here at SMTA Ohio. I'm with Laren Welk with Smart Slice. How are you doing today? Great, thank you. Now, you got the white lab coat. Is it safe to say you are a professor? Oh yeah, everybody knows it. All right, so from now on, I'm gonna start calling you Professor okay. Welk. Professor Welk. All right, Welk. so let's start off. So tell me about Smart Splice. What are you guys known for? Uh, we're known for tape splicing materials. Uh, we've been doing it through different companies for 25 years. Okay. Uh, we've done uh, quite a few re evolutions over the years. We've been through uh, pick and place companies. We've done it through there. But now it's in 2004, we started Smart Splice on its own and only doing tape splicing. So we just concentrate on tape splicing. Got it, okay. Now how long have you been with Smart Splice? Uh, we started it together with my partner and I since 2004. Oh. But I've been doing the industry since uh, 19, 86. So you're one of the co-founders of the company, am I understanding yes, that correctly? Yeah. Oh, one of the co and you're out here at the trade show, yeah. man. You're hands on, you're a busy yeah. man. Yeah. All right, so it's pretty awesome to be out here in person. I mean, it's great to look around and see all these people because yeah. I imagine you're just like the rest of us have been locked down for the last 18 months, right? Yeah, it's good to be out again. Yeah, uh, we actually got our first customer visits in yesterday, which awesome. is always good. So. Where are you guys based out of? Uh, we have two offices. I'm in Myrtle Beach, South Carolina. Oh, cool. And we have one in uh, Westminster, Maryland. All right, so county you how long ago did you start the company? Uh, since 2004. Okay, how, how has the last 18 months been with COVID? Unbelievable, in a good way. Oh, yeah, good. Business has tripled for us in the last 18 months. Well, that, that is awesome. Yeah. It's been an absolute pleasure to meet you. I love the you lab coat. All right. I love everything you got going on. Right. But before we do go, you got some cool stuff up here, man. So why don't you give me a quick lesson? Because I don't even know what I'm looking at. Uh, basically, it's a way to splice uh, material that go on a pick and place machine. If somebody tells you that their machine does so many placements an hour, mm -hmm. that's that's a, a theory that they use to do that, but it doesn't include changing feeders, putting uh, material into feeders. So what this allows you to do is actually splice on the fly. So you can splice the next reel onto the reel that's already on the machine. So the machine never stops. So when they say it can do 10,000 or 20,000 parts an hour, there's no reason that it can't because you're not gonna run it out of parts because you're gonna splice a new reel onto an old reel while it's on the, yeah. while it's on the fly. That, that's awesome. That's a tremendous value add because the yep. two most important things I hear that all these companies are focusing on is how they can make it smaller and make it faster because yeah. throughput yeah. is throughput. the ultimate. Yeah. I mean, that's what drives the revenue, right? Yeah. yeah. Awesome. Well, I appreciate your time. Thank no you so problem. much for sharing. All right. And uh, let me know you. if I can do anything for you. All right. Thank you.